We're joined by Kevin, uh, Greg, Greg Newman of Scotia Wealth Management. He joins us now with more. Greg, great to have you here, first great of all. Thanks, here. thanks for joining us yeah. as a featured guest. I just want to share with viewers a couple of comments from Canadian economists uh, on uh, the Bank of Canada and its rate hikes. Andrew Kelvin, head of Canadian Global Rate Strategy, uh, said in a note yesterday, we believe 5% will mark the terminal rate for the Bank of Canada this cycle and still look for the first rate cut, cut in the second quarter of 2024. So TD Bank and its economics team believes that the Bank of Canada is now finished with rate hikes in this cycle. At National Bank of Canada, not to be confused with the Bank of Canada, but at National Bank of Canada, uh, economists there say, uh, quote, we don't think further rate increases are or will be warranted. Additional hikes are not in our base case outlook. We hope to get more clarity from the bank tomorrow, i.e. today, when uh, Tiff Macklin delivers his economic progress report in Calgary. What do you think? Do you agree? Do you think the bank is You know, the right? only trouble with everybody being on the same side is that uh, consensus can be wrong. Uh, you know, I, I do agree with these opinions. I think that uh, the Canadian economy has been showing signs of some slugg sluggishness. Uh, you know, even Europe is starting to slow a little bit. China has continued to be a drag. And prices continue to trend in the right direction. Uh, that is all a positive. Uh, even oil prices, you know, Brent at $90 is not that much of a problem on a year-over-year -year basis. So. Uh, all in, I think that the economists are going to be right, <clears throat> but it, uh, you have to be somewhat fearful of the fact that uh, everybody seems to be on the same side of this boat. As always, people, uh, economists, uh, were very uh, diligent in looking at the statement and comparing it to previous statements. And, and National Bank of Canada makes the point that, there, uh, quote, there was an explicit threat to tighten further. And they cited this part portion of the Bank of Canada statement yesterday uh, that the bank is, quote, prepared to increase the policy interest rate further uh, if needed. Uh, what do we make of that statement? Uh, and again, think, that's different from what the bank, that's different phrasing than the bank has used in the recent yeah, past. Yeah, I think this is walking softly and carrying a big stick. I think that, you know, um, if you don't get inflation under control, it's really bad over the long term. And so they have to get this right. Uh, at the same time, they just don't want to crush the economy. So uh, I think that uh, plain lip service to the fact that, you know, they're going to come back out, they're going to stand data dependent, they're going to do what they need to do, they're going to be as aggressive as they need to, um, carries a message without necessarily having, you know, um, too draconian of an, of an outcome. That's Greg Newman on our talk.